My name is Chris Hopkins and I'm here with Real Infused Exotics to take you through the next series of cocktails that we have in this line. Today we're going through retro cocktails. Let's get started. The first cocktail we're going to make is a twist on the Cosmopolitan that we are calling just a classic strawberry Cosmo. Starting off with one and a half ounces of a nice citrus vodka. Adding in three quarters of an ounce of a nice bright orange liqueur or triple sec. Keeping in the classic theme with the Cosmopolitan, we're gonna go with an ounce of fresh, nice cranberry juice. Nice bright pink color there. For the citrus, we're gonna take a little bit of a shift out of the normal world and we're gonna add some lemon juice. So here we're gonna add just a half an ounce to add a little bit of brightness and acidity. We're gonna finish that off with a little bit of strawberry real. A nice bright strawberry puree. There we go. We get some ice. And we give it a shake. To finish, we're just gonna strain it into this lovely wine glass we have, replicating what would normally be a martini glass. We're gonna finish that off really simply with a nice freshly cut strawberry to really emphasize that fresh fruit. And there we have it, the Strawberry Cosmopolitan. The next cocktail we're gonna go into in the retro series is something we call the Fuzzy Navel Redux. So let's get started. First of all, we're gonna start off with a nice ounce and a half of a beautiful aged Reposado tequila. Next, we're gonna add half an ounce of lime juice, adding in a nice little pop of citrus. Classically to the recipe, we're gonna go with two ounces of orange juice. And then to really bring that navely peachy part together, we're gonna to go with a half or three quarter ounce of the Real Infused Exotic Peach. And we're gonna give that a bit of a shake. We're gonna pour it into a salted glass using the ice already in there just for a little bit of fun. And then finally, we're gonna to top that off with two ounces of a nice bright club soda. It's really letting all those flavors come together. We're gonna to finish that off with a nice slice of orange. And there we have it, the Fuzzy Navel Redux. We look forward to seeing how you're mixing with Real at home, so get into the comments and let us know soon. And until the next series, we'll see you then.